Hello ladies and gentlemen, I am the Grand Cat and today we are going to pro the first double heroic event card from season 10. It is the Crucible Eddie Guerrero that we got from Ring Domination and the previous Giants Unleashed which was a event certainly. But let's go ahead, they are both on their 100 matches, they are both level 100 and I think I'm going to go with this Eddie Guerrero for them. Uh, now we can't use them so if we have to remove everything there and we're going combine yes we would like to pro our cards and here we go there it is there is <clears throat> our first ever double heroic pro there is the animation for it there's a lot of working and moving parts going on here the saws in the background and these little metal parts and everything there's the big swinging blades in the background um, hmm. <laughs> I'm not sure what this is supposed to be. It looks like some kind of like saw trap from like the saw movies, but very, very cool indeed. So let's see. He's currently only on level zero. I don't have anything to train him up, unfortunately. So we're just going to compare what he's like with the rest of them. And you can see that on level zero, he's well, we're going to lock him down. He's actually already stronger than what our level 105 pro Farouk is. Now Farouk doesn't have his 100 matches, he only has 63 and but Farouk also has this up arrow going on here as well. He has the uh, equipment and Eddie Guerrero with no equipment whatsoever is actually stronger. He's still just a tiny bit weaker than our pro Hulk Hogan and then our fortified one Chad Gable is just a little bit stronger than that. In fact actually in retrospect I think I actually have momentum on those cards. Yes, I do. So if we... Let's just swap out the momentum with... Anyone else. And... There we go. Just make it all females. Then let's compare the males. And... Well, it says nothing's changed here, but maybe it hasn't updated. So if we go back out and go back in, let's see if it changes. Nope, it's still the same. Although we can now see that Luke Gallows, with his equipment, is actually stronger. In fact, actually, Farouk is actually weaker than our Gobbledygooker. That is crazy. That just goes to show that Gobbledygooker is actually very, very strong. And then our next up is the Fortified 2 Noir Goldberg, followed by the Fortified 2 Carrion Cross, before we go into our single American Nightmare Cody Rhodes, which is Crucible. We still have a whole load of cards here that need to be trained up. But you can see that I think when this Eddie Guerrero goes to level 105, he's, only, he's very easily going to be the strongest card in the entire game thus far. But they'll go very nicely with my Chad Gable because then we'll have the wonderful up and down arrow. And then we've got Hulk Hogan with Luke Gallows being the next one in line. But I need to get these matches up to 100 on all these cards here so that I can see what these are actually proper like once they are fully evolved and I think I still have a couple more cards to pro yeah we've got this fortified one noir undertaker that I need to get around to and then I have a whole load of these that need to be done but there we go folks that is it we have got our pro Eddie Guerrero he is very very cool the heroic ring nomination is done and let's take a quick look at the login so the next event is going to be Clash of Champions, which, well, let's see here, there is a Save Santa that's coming out tomorrow, then on Wednesday, I think this is just Wild Wednesday, oh, the Crucible Rarity Fusion has been added, so we'll get to see the new fusions, then we've got Clash of Champions, which I really hope that it isn't CM Punk, because I would spend so much money trying to get a high-ranking CM Punk. Uh, then we have a 100% off wall bonus, which starts next Saturday. Then we've got the watch party for NXT Deadline, which I will be doing the, the usual predictions video for it. Then following Monday, um, <coughs> if you meet the Daily Streak, check the... Oh, this is the, the Daily Streak, which you, you claim for 14 rewards in a row to get a special bonus. I assume that's on the lead up to Christmas. Then we have the Women's War Games, 
which is actually going to be a flash event because women's war games we can expect it to be a female and that is going to be followed by road to glory which is also going to be a flash event and then following that on thursday which is going to be the 21st of december is going to be giants unleashed and that's going to go straight through up until christmas and then on the 25th which is christmas day itself it says make sure to grab a free gift this day available at 12 p.m so i think that's going to be a little christmas present for everyone and then we're going to get the second half of the giants unleashed event which is going to be in war games and that will lead us right up to the end of the year leading into 2024 so very very exciting month to see a whole load of stuff we're still just at the start of season 10 that's as we've got done our first double heroic event pro of the entire season and we've got much much more to look forward to before the end of this year and also if you are if you have been watching our little videos do check out my little advent calendar it has a whole bunch of little one piece figurines in it it doesn't get an awful lot of views but it is something that is special to me so if you do like my content i think you might enjoy that as well although i know a lot of you are just here for w supercard but that is going to be it for this little video folks i really hope you all enjoyed if you did enjoy it please give me a like share and subscribe and if you are subscribed make sure you click that notification icon so you can see when more of these glorious little videos go out and we shall see you all in the next video goodbye everybody